The vintages that you see mostly in the market right now is 2005, to start with the, the older one. That is a great vintage in any corner of the wine hemisphere on this globe. Glorious vintage. 2006, a difficult vintage. Very small in quantity, but a lot of botrytis. And um, the, uh, the concentration of the 06 is enormous. And when you look on the, on the label and you read Cabinet or Spätleser, you, you can always be sure that this is heavily downgraded. Actually, you get much more wine for what is written on the label. It's a typical example, underexpose, overdeliver. So 06 really has a rich, pungent, opulent, creamy character. It has great fruit and great acid at great density. You, you get oily uh, flavors from the botrytis, you get very quince and rhubarb flavors on the more cleaner or more less botrytis uh, grape wines, so that you find in the 06 vintage. The next 07 is very elegant. It's a very elegant, a lush and elegant, has not the top end style that 05 has got, but in the QBA is a cabinet and spade laser and even the Auslaser is a classy vintage. Very elegant, lean, a vintage to age perfectly. Now 08, we are a little bit more crunchy and uh, spicy and zesty than 07. 08 has got a higher acid and a little bit lower alcohol than 07. So if you are looking for the then time light style cabinet, in German wines and you didn't see it recently, go and find 08, you will have it. Now, 09, we are already a year further on. 09 is just in uh, Statu Nascendi. Yeah, we, um, uh, we are tasting and sampling and preparing the first bottlings of 09. It's highly concentrated. It's small, relatively small in quantity. It comes close to 05. I don't know whether it will be similar to 05, but it goes in the direction of 05. So whatever we see from German wines on the shelf, be sure you will never run into an off vintage. Whatever vintage, the importing agent, the distributor, the restaurateur, the retailer, or the customer picks, he can be sure or she can be sure always to have a very good vintage above average. That is so far the positive effect of global warming, as we can see it in the Mosul, so far. But we haven't seen the end yet. Yeah.